<clears throat> Hello, and to today I'm going to review my my very first modern tank. Um, this is the first one I've made in my whole entire life. You know, I'm basically a World War II guy, and you know, houses, castle, pretty much everything except for this. Uh, but I try my hands because now I'm coming January, January. I will start. I will make uh, a bunch. No, not a bunch. Actually, four apocalypse scenes. It will be on the large grey base plate, I think I will make about four. And I needed a tank for it. I know I've already ordered the body armor for <coughs> the figures and really needed a tank. So hey, one build one. <coughs> so here it is. I think it looks uh, very nice. It's um you know, a great inspiration source was Andrew Summers, which is, um, honest opinion, the best modern tank builder on the whole internet. Check him out. Uh, oh, what the fuck! I'll put a link in the description to his to his Flickr. Um, you will be amazed. His tanks are just stunning. Um, yeah, let's start. I don't know where to start. Maybe take it as ordinary. Just take the front. <coughs> Here's the front, um, it's just nothing really special, uh, the mod guards, and yeah, nothing nothing really much to it. Uh, the sides, we have uh, the side skirts here, and Suspension. Of course, there's suspension. That's pretty awesome. Yeah. Suspension. Back. Back is awesome. Exhausts. This big fat thing. It's got a fat ass. It's a fat ass tank. I have some weird wheels on this side, you know. There's also something I have to order, more of those wheels here. You know the back fell off. It only says on the four studs. The back. Oh, by the way, name! I actually named it. It's a... I call it a... Uh, Dodge Hunter Tank. Medium... Medium Hunter Tank. And no, Dodge... The car company doesn't make tanks. But I love this sign, you know. Love that, and... Little slogan, take a life of the horns. Um, so I just thought that's perfect. So it's I call it Dodge Hunter. Pretty awesome. Yeah. Uh, now to the most special part of this, which is the turret. It's a big ass turret. This turret is pretty much to say the size of my pencil one. <laughs> it's extremely big. <coughs> And the gun barrel moves up and down and shoot your ass off. Very nice shape to it. You can easily lift off lift it off. So for this thing that doesn't want to get lift off. So yeah, here it is. It's like I said, the biggest tank I've made, the biggest short I made. Yep. And it has an opening hatch. Right there. It opens when it really feels for opening. So that doesn't open, this will looks. Machine gun comes runs all the way. The browning. And those hatch it's got three hatches in the back. Right there. More here. Yeah. Pretty lame review. Sorry for that, guys. Um, yeah, that is pretty much it for this review. My first modern tank review, and I have my table here just because my um, ordinary little film studio photo taking setup was too small. <laughs> yeah, I hope you enjoyed this, and goodbye.